Hey everybody, it's Sir Sox Bigly. Welcome back to day number 10 of the 13 day spooky calendar countdown to Halloween from Funko Pocket Pops. So. I'm going by, going by my viewfinder instead of my actual eyes. So. My scissors to open this up. And, oh, Audrey 2 from Little Shop of Horrors. Oh, that's really cool. Um, yeah, so, I, I, Little Shop of Horrors, the, of course, this is the 60s, was it 60s? No. The second one, Rick Mar Moranis. Um, don't know when it was made, maybe possibly the 80s. But, yeah, this version was shown on TV a lot when I was growing up, so... Yeah, I've seen this movie countless, countless, countless times. I do remember probably the first uh, first anything from this movie I've ever been, was exposed to was the uh, I Am Your Dentist song uh, sung by uh, Steve Martin. It was probably, I think it was broadcast on the Dr. Demento show. He, he played that once. So, yeah, Audrey 2. Uh, of course, if you don't know the movie, the... A plant from outer space comes down and eats humans and thrives and becomes big and huge. Give me one moment. Sorry. Sorry about that. Got a little something behind the scenes going on. So anyway, so uh, yeah, Audrey 2, which was voice. Oh, yeah. The voice of this, same person who did uh, Mother Brain from Captain N, which, uh, yeah. That's a, that's a shocker. So, and if a lot of you who didn't know that, you're like, oh, yeah, it makes sense now. So, yeah. Uh, of course, for some, for some reason, they made this into a musical. The original film was black and white. Of course, the people, I, I think it must be in public domain because everybody in the grammar releases it on DVD. And when they do, it says starring Jack Nicholson, <laughs> even though he's got like a bit part in the movie. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, he plays the same character that Bill Murray played in the, uh, the remake. The kind of wacko doodle guy who wants to go into the dentist. Yeah, I like pain. Yeah, <laughs> or something. So yeah, that's Audrey two. It's Audrey. Audrey one was the girl that uh, Seymour was in love with. That alien outer space plant who feeds on human beings. So yep, yeah. uh, some good detail there. There's blood on the lips. Tongue goes all the way back, and uh, in the flower pot. Really cool. So that was day number 10. Almost there. Three more days to go. So we, before we hit day number 13, we punched that in, so I'm going to open it again. Uh, yeah. I'm still wondering what might be downstairs here. G judging from the the, the uh, properties that's, for whatever reason, mentioned on the outside of the box. Good. <laughs> Spoilers. Um... There's a few things that weren't mentioned there, so and there's more days than there are that. So they did have two from Beetlejuice, so I think that uh, took up one of the spots. Anyway, uh, come back tomorrow for day number eleven, and we will be closing this up soon. So stay with us, watch all thirteen days, and if you skipped any, if you just, you're just coming in, go back, watch the rest of them, catch up, and we'll see you tomorrow for day number eleven. Bye.